Many Americans have been wondering why Donald Trump's Justice Department has still not cracked down on Hillary Clinton for her many criminal activities. Now, the answer why may have been revealed, as it appears Attorney General Jeff Sessions has been protecting her all along. Over the past few weeks, numerous evidence has surfaced that the Uranium One deal was pushed through during Clinton's time as Secretary of State despite the fact the Russians had compromised American contractors in the nuclear industry and an FBI mole informed the Obama administration of bribery, money laundering, and kickback schemes between those involved with the deal. The informant explained that Russia hatched a plan to obtain America's uranium basically employing every method they possibly could to do so. The Russians were compromising American contractors in the nuclear industry with kickbacks and extortion threats, all of which raised legitimate national security concerns, The Hill reported. And none of that evidence got aired before the Obama administration made those decisions, a person who worked on the case told The Hill, speaking on condition of anonymity for fear of retribution by U.S. or Russian officials. This means that the FBI was aware of the Russians' plot to secure American uranium at all costs, yet did absolutely nothing to stop the deal at the time. John Solomon of The Hill revealed that Sessions has been downplaying the new information from the informant in what seems to be an attempt to protect Clinton and her cohorts. Solomon wrote that, both Attorney General Jeff Sessions in testimony last week and Deputy Attorney General Rod Rosenstein in a letter to the Senate last month tried to suggest there was no connection between Uranium One and the nuclear bribery case. Their argument was that the criminal charges weren't filed until 2014, while the Committee of Foreign Investment in the United States CFIUS, approval of the Uranium One sale occurred in October 2010. However, this was a blatant lie, and many people in Congress are not happy about what Sessions said. There is zero doubt we had evidence of criminal activity before the CFIUS approval and that Justice knew about it through the Natural Security Division, said one source. Attorney General Sessions seemed to say that the bribery, racketeering and money laundering offenses involving 10 exes Vadim Micron occurred after the approval of the Uranium One deal by the Obama administration. But we know that the FBI's confidential informant was actively compiling incriminating evidence as far back as 2009, added Rep. Ron DeSantis. It is hard to fathom how such a transaction could have been approved without the existence of the underlying corruption being disclosed. I hope A.G. Sessions gets briefed about this and gives the Uranium One case the scrutiny it deserves, added DeSantis whose House Oversight and Government Reform Subcommittee is one of the investigating panels. Panels?